We have about four rows up. We're gonna add two more rows. Originally, we thought we were gonna do about nine rows, but it's looking like we only need about six rows for this hillside. We've been backfilling with soil, sculpting. Uh, we've come across a few areas where the ground, the hillside was a little uneven. So we've had to move some J hooks and make some adjustments just to make sure that those lines look nice and everything's looking even. We've been using a tractor with a front loader to dump the soil at the top so we can let gravity do all the work and backfill those dirt lockers with soil. And then once we install the bottom two rows, we're actually gonna bring the tractor around front and dump the soil in to make our life a little bit easier. One thing to remember is to always make sure that your dirt locker faces are vertical, straight up and down. The width of your dirt locker is dependent upon your slope angle. So that's why we say to set them to 24 inches, 30 inches, or 36 inches wide, depending on your slope angle.